Hi everybody, I'm Ben Mankiewicz. Welcome to TCM, where we're in the middle of tonight's lineup of movies with Jewish characters front and center. Up next, a drama from 1978 about two New York roommates, directed, produced, and co-written by Claudia Weil, Girlfriends. The story follows the tensions that develop between two close friends and roommates, Susan and Anne, when one chooses to pursue a career and the other settles into life as a housewife. Susan is career-focused. She makes a living photographing weddings and bar mitzvahs, aspires to be a more serious photographer. Anne, on the other hand, chooses to focus on her marriage, which Susan begins to resent. Girlfriends was initially conceived as a short film about roommates in the city, but it evolved into a feature-length production when filmmaker Claudia Weil and her screenwriting partner, Vicki Polon, decided to explore what happens to Susan after Anne moves out and gets married. Shooting began on location in Manhattan in 1975, but it took three years for Weil to secure the financing to complete her film. At various points, she got some money from the New York State Council on the Arts, the National Endowment for the Arts, and the American Film Institute. Weil anticipated that her film would rely on a small independent distributor, but much to her surprise, Hollywood expressed interest. And when the movie was screened over at Warner Brothers, studio executives saw its promise and bought the worldwide distribution rights. Weil believed the success of Woody Allen's Annie Hall, released in 1977, piqued Hollywood's interest in intimate, offbeat stories about relationships in New York. Girlfriends debuted in New York in 1978, though its premiere coincided with a newspaper strike in the city, making it hard to publicize. To drum up interest, Weil stood outside the downtown theater, along with two of the film's stars, Melanie Mayron and Eli Wallach, and distributed handbills to New Yorkers walking past. The movie was well received. Stanley Kubrick said it was one of the most interesting American films he'd seen in years. From 1978, also with Anita Skinner and Christopher Guest, Girlfriends. Before making Girlfriends, filmmaker Claudia Weil worked exclusively on non-fiction films, both as a cinematographer and as a director. She also wrote and directed segments for public television, earning some visibility in 1972 with the production of Joyce at 34, a short film about balancing the demands of being a mother and a working professional. When Shirley MacLaine saw Joyce at 34, she was so moved that she recruited Weil to help direct, photograph, and edit a documentary she was making. The Other Half of the Sky, a China memoir about the first women's delegation to China in 1973. The documentary earned an Oscar nomination, and with the attention it received, Weil was able to slowly secure the financing for her first feature. She chose to film Girlfriends almost as if it were a documentary, which gave it that authentic feel. Coming up, Gene Wilder and Harrison Ford star in a Western comedy from 1979, directed by Robert Aldrich. The Frisco Kid is next on TCM.